Hey guys, welcome back to my home. I'm still wearing the same sweater. I just got done doing the video for my collaboration and I'm super stoked. Super, 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 super stoked. So I can't wait for y'all to see the amazing projects that these girls come up with. I, I, I can't, I can't fathom. I think we've got a great group of, of, of crafters in this collaboration. So I'm super excited. But that's not why we're here. So I have to do this very quickly. I have a lot going on this week. Um, I went to the Dollar Tree to look for some items um, on some of my, my uh, subscribers or subbies uh, wish list. And then also went to pick up a bunch of snacks. I'm getting ready to make a trip. Um, and my husband wants to come with me. So I pick up snacks for them and my girls because it's going to be a pretty long tri trip. So without further ado, -do, let's get started with this. Oh, shall we? So the first thing that I had to pick up is... Um, I, I'm finishing up the last of my daughter's school supplies and I think I got everything that I need now. I pulled up the list from um, the website and apparently they needed some sheet protectors. So the Dollar Tree sells these sheet protectors. Um, they're 16 to a pack. So I got her two packs. I don't know how many she's going to need. Um, but just to be safe, Minnie, you're supposed to keep her busy. I, I got her two packs. And then I talked to you guys. I'm a I'm OCD about organization and making sure everything's organized. So, you know, y'all know that I'm a I do um, I'm a construction project manager in, in my civilian world in my world outside of YouTube. So I like to keep my projects organized um, in folders. Um, so usually what I do is I put my plans, I put any any important documentations and things of that nature, and these folders that the Dollar Tree put out. They're trifolds. They're amazing. So I hauled a pink one and I picked up three different ones, three different colors because then I can color code each one of my projects and I'll know, oh, that's this project. Oh, that's that project. And when I travel, because I, I have to travel depending on the project and I take these in my backpack. So you can see this is my handy dandy backpack. Um, I can pull out the project folder really quickly. So yeah, those were really good. And then she needed some wide ruled paper. I'm so happy. This means she's a big girl now because she's actually using paper. Oh, I forgot to find, get you the ring binder. Darn it. Excuse me. And I've never seen this before, but the Dollar Tree has color computer paper. It's got different colors. I haven't opened it, but I saw the pink and the blue. And I was like, oh, this will be so cute. Like if I want to print something cute up or a calendar for my daughter or something for school. Because um, I like putting calendars in front of her desk and stuff. This will be really cute for her for school. So I picked that up. And then she also needed um, some construction paper. I don't know how many she needed. So I picked up two packs of this construction paper. And if it's, you can never have too much uh, school supplies. Because you know these kids, they lose everything. So I'd rather have extra than not enough. And if I have extra, then we can use it for projects, right? We can always use construction paper and stuff like that. So that's not a big deal. And then I picked these up for one of my subbies. Um, they actually, I was able to find them. I went yesterday. They didn't have any to the same Dollar Tree. And I went today and they brought them back. So that's why you guys need to go to the Dollar Tree like every day. Because I literally was at that Dollar Tree yesterday looking for these stickers to send them to my sub. And I'm like, man, I'm going to send her mine because I feel so bad. And God blessed me. There were tons of them out there today. So this is going to one of my subbies. And then I found one lonely container. So I found two pink ones for my last haul. And then I had the two blue ones. So I'm going to use the two blue. This reminds me of Blippi. This reminds me of Blippi. Blippi. Oh, yeah. If you don't know Blippi, if you don't so check them out. Blippi. He loves blue and orange. So I got blue and orange containers to put my stickers in because oh. I have to organize them. So I found one. One. And then, guys, there's it's not over. Let's start with the snacks. So I bought these for my husband because he loves these Oreos. I bought these for my daughter because she loves these chips ahoys. I love these kernels, especially when they don't have the shell because they're so much easier. And then my husband loves these corn nuts, so I bought him 
Oh no, this bag is open. Never mind. That's going in the trash. Check your bags before you buy them. But I like these, so I bought myself these. And then I bought a pack of these. My daughter likes the ones without the peanuts, and my husband likes the ones with the peanuts. Yay, I'm in there. So I picked those up for our little adventure. And then, too many snacks, guys. Too many snacks. I just, it's easier. I picked up some of these potato chips for them. My husband said to pick up some Cheez-Its. The baby loves Cheez-Its, so those will be for her. My husband loves moon pies. He doesn't know I picked these up for him, but I did just because we're gonna be, we're gonna, we're, it's a long drive and you know, it's, it's the drive that we're making, we're making it straight there. We're gonna sleep for a couple hours and then we're gonna basically drive back. So, oh Lord, maybe. Sorry guys, I got a mess down here. My girls are just not helping here, not helping. So I picked up these straws. I have an emergency backpack in my truck and that emergency backpack has like tons of things that my husband puts put inside of it um, in case my car breaks down or something. And then I also have like what we call MREs, meal ready, meal ready um, food from the military. I have a box of that. I have some water. I have some plates. I, yeah, we're that kind of family. That's what happens when you've been in the military too long. You just get crazy like that. Well, I needed some straws because my baby only drinks out of straws. So I bought her straws. Here, I bought you straws. These. Here's your straws. Do you need this, Mama? Uh, uh, those are your snacks. Put them on top of your desk because those are going to be for the trip. Okay. And then I bought two of these. So I, I need to try to, I need to get everything that I've promised everybody, which all, most of it is on my table, um, out tomorrow because on Wednesday, um, I'm taking off and I won't be back for about three days and then um, I'm going to be making a huge transition guys so um, I am working on develop developing a business a business deal here and it's taking me out of state so my girls and I are moving very fast. And what I mean, I'm gonna be relocating to the state of Alabama within the next week and a half, two weeks. Um, I need to be there by the 26th because I have to register my daughter in school because they start on August 5th. Um, so this is really fast. Um, so today, literally I spent my day going through the school stuff to see what I gotta get for her. Um, finding a place, I found a town home that's near um, where I'm gonna be working. Um, and then I need to find a, um, a nanny. Um, somebody that's local to help me out with my girls because I don't wanna put my baby in a daycare, so. And then my daughter, she's gonna be taking the bus to and from school, so I need somebody to be there because um, I'm gonna start working. I wanna start work super early. I can start as early as six in the morning. That's what I love about this business. And then I can get out by three or 3.30, you know? So that is perfect. And I'm literally about 25 minutes away from work. So that's why I've been so busy, guys. And for the next two weeks, I'm just gonna be like, phew. I never sleep. I never sleep. So, yeah. Anyways, let me go back. I, I, I lost it. About my daughter. So, yeah, I need to get these hauls out tomorrow. That's that's Basically, that's what I bought these for. <laughs> wow. And then I bought these scissors. My daughter needs two scissors at the school. So, I had already bought her one, but I picked up two more just because, I don't know, she loses stuff. So, at least I have extra ones. Guys, I, I haven't seen this tr this trim at the Dollar Tree. Look how pretty this is. It's got pom-poms and it's all different kind of colors. So I picked two of those up because I love working with pom-poms. And then I picked this up for a subby. I was able to find one, so I picked it up for my subby and I'll be sending that off to her tomorrow. I needed to pick this up for my husband. I had like two sets of these and I don't know for the life of me where they're at and I'm not gonna look for them right now. I don't have time. So I picked this up for him so that he can have it. Um, I guess he's gotta fix his glasses. And then I picked these up for the road trip. When you stay in a hotel room, those cups are too little. And your girl, she Puerto Rican and she need a lot of coffee, okay? Oh. 
lots and lots of coffee. Not those little styrofoam cups that are like this little. I need this. Not, this is still small, but this will work better than the little cups, right? So those will be going in my backpack. And then, guys, I bought tons of tape. Your girl got to start packing everything up. So I was able to find free boxes, and my husband went to get them today. Um, somebody just re PCS here from another um, station. They're stationed here in Fort Knox, so she had tons of boxes. Um, so I'm like, hey, can I get them? And so my husband went to pick up all the free boxes for me today. I got tape, and I'm going to start packing everything up. So guys, wish me luck. You think I can do it? I think I can do it. I did this last time. When I came here to Fort Knox, my boss, my the the guy that hired me gave me two weeks. Two weeks to relocate. I had my house packed. My husband helped me move the rest of the stuff here. Slowly, we moved things over. All I brought were the clothes that we needed. I didn't bring anything extra. We, we brought things as I, I got settled down. I came to Kentucky. I lived in a hotel with my two girls for a week. And then we went to Fort Knox and lived with my husband in four brick walls for like two months until we found a town home that we moved into. And we lived in the town home. We leased it for a while until we found this house. And we're getting ready to do a crazy stunt again. But this is worth it because my husband retires next year in May. And he has paid his dues. And he will not be working when he retires. So your girl... Oh, that's not bad. I reserved it. Oh, you reserved it? Oh, I didn't see that. For I have to do it for a trailer. So we oh. can have one. So, um, yeah. It's kind of where we're at. So tomorrow I'll be making calls to some of the townhomes that I found for my daughters and I. And then I'm going to start interviewing nannies next week after I get everything settled in with this company. And yeah, like I said, it's it moved really fast. Everything happened today. Literally, everything happened this morning. When I woke up, I checked my emails and I'm like... <gasps> what i told my husband i'm like uh i'm moving to alabama he was like what i'm like yeah so two weeks guys i gotta have all everything done in two weeks i gotta be moved in so when i talk to them on thursday i'm gonna see if i can work from home for at least a couple weeks i need to settle in get the nanny in and, and get her situated and then making sure that my daughter gets, you know, at least a couple days in with school before I go to work. So I'm going to see if I can get a couple weeks in the work from home just so that I can get um, acclimated with the area since I'm going to be alone with them. And yeah, we'll, we'll take it from there. So yeah, guys, it's a long story. I'm sorry. I apologize. Uh, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment down below. Hook smash that subscribe button! Yes, ma'am. Smash the subscribe button. Deuces. Bye, guys. Thanks for listening to my rambles. Bye.